Welcome to At Home Net's Feature Support Series. In this video, we're going to add a drop-down list to an e-form. A drop-down list is a very useful tool as it allows a person to see a list of choices but select only one. Now let's add a new drop-down list to our pool hours survey here. When editing our e-form, we'll go to the bottom and click Edit Form Fields and then click the link that says add a new field to this eForm. Now you can also get to this screen when you're creating a new eForm. First we'll enter our label which is the question we're asking in this field. Next we choose our field type which is going to be a drop-down. When you click drop-down you'll see this new window appear. This allows you to enter your list box items. Simply enter your selections and click the Add button to see them listed below. You can continue listing them as far as you need. And even reorder them once you're done. Click the Save button and then save again to add the field to your eForm. Now we can move our question into the proper location just by dragging and dropping it. There's no need to save when you're moving an eForm field. Now we can go back and visit our eForm and we'll see our new drop-down list with the choices that we entered. I hope that you have enjoyed this training video. You can view our other training videos online at www.youtube.com forward slash at home net. Thank <music> you.